Okay, I'm trying to let you see the colors, but basically the black, and it's 100% cotton. It was made in Peru. Abdad, he is a designer, and I absolutely love this shirt. I got it from a guy in lockdown, and I had on khaki pants, new, perfect fit. I had on a nice shirt, and so he had a job interview coming up, and by very aggressive uh, maneuvering, he got this job interview coming up, so they wanted to get him out of detox as quick as possible. And uh, what happened was he didn't have clothes for an interview, and he was kind of obsessed with that. So he gave me his shirt and his jeans, jeans too tight, I'll wear those someday though. And I gave him the brand new khakis and the white shirt. He got the better of the deal for sure. But this was a really interesting character. He was super manic and uh, he talked about being in prison in a big, huge open area of, uh, prisoners that down in Florida he got arrested for uh, he got arrested for breaking into cars and he told the story of how he almost got away uh, he lied and uh, he laid lied lied in the bushes laid in the bushes and they, they brought dogs with him and they got his scent and the first time the dog went right past him and kept going and he would have no idea that the second time the dog passed, they found him. But I think he should have just run right after the first time the dog missed him. And without causing a lot of commotion, he probably could have been gone. I don't know how far they went past him, but it's certainly enough time to crawl out and, and run or anything you can do. But... And the nurses liked him because he treated the nurses differently than everybody else did there. They're kind of, you know, your future depends on that, but he didn't have that attitude <laughs> at all. He would do all kinds of things, sneak in crackers, and they went through all of your possessions every day, and they'd always catch him with crackers, and they, they didn't seem to mind that. They seemed to find that as humorous. And he was very outspoken and uh, manic. And uh, Maddie came in one time and we just kind of watched him in action. I'm not going to say his name. We just kind of watched him in action and he absolutely could not stand still. I don't know how he could stand being arrested. And uh, Maddie really came through during that period. Uh, he was there every day for seven days and, and had a lot of uh, influence over the doctors and the procedures except for the VTAC, which he just said casually, oh, they just need to readjust your pick line and it was pushing into your heart. I thought, oh, okay. But uh, lots of characters that I'll remember forever, close characters, friends, and... Uh, that was that was a while ago, as Bernadette says. That was a while ago. <laughs>